World Boss Brooks. This is Henny on deck. He's gonna give you some information on some Hennessy you've probably never even seen or heard of before. But if, if it's Hennessy, I'll let you know about it. Hip hop has been influenced by cognac, and cognac's been influenced by hip hop. And you see that in modern times where somebody like Jay Z has has his own cognac, which is uh. His XO, which is one of the best on the, on the market right now, and uh, you have uh, a couple other artists have came out with cognacs and coming out with liquors to, to, to go along with the hip hop. Oh, I, I, <laughs> I was just amazed at the bottom. <laughs> this is the first time I've seen it. It's it's been rated the top XO for the past, in the top XOs in the past four or five years. So we're gonna find out what it, what it does compared to a Hennessy XO today. Let's see if it really compares. Price wise, it, it's maybe a little bit less than, than a, a Hennessy XO or about the same, but some people argue if you're getting a better XO, why not buy this instead of the Hennessy, but Hennessy brand is too big for any cognac to try to take them out. They, they've been around too long and, and it's just the name that everybody knows. So it's hard for somebody to come in the game and try to take them out as far as cognacs. But this apparently is doing pretty good as far as the XOs. The, 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 the BS, it, it, it's not really selling as well, I would say, because everybody's going to go into a store and the first thing they're going to see is Hennessy and that's the first thing they're going to pick because they know the brand, they know the name. Price-wise, they're, as I said, they're both about the same. We'll see if they're worth it when, when, we, when we open it later today. And you're on deck.